Hey guys, Patrice here with another video. This time this is my weekly empties. Today is Thursday. I'm filming it a little early. My boyfriend is on call, so he's going to be at home tonight and tomorrow and this weekend. So anyways, this week I solely focused on getting through some of my Ella after my melting basket. And guys, this wasn't the best melting week. Um, you guys know I'm fully honest and open. Um, I love Ella After. She's probably my number one brand. Um, but this week, I don't know what happened, whether it was my AC, it was the weather, it was the wax is coming up on a year and a half old. I don't know. I don't know what it was, but this week wasn't the best week. So, but don't discourage that from trying this vendor and stuff. Like, you guys know that I... I'll cut a vendor off. If their stuff isn't performing or up to what I think, I just cut them off. I stop ordering because I'm not going to keep hoping that something works for me that just doesn't. But this just wasn't the best week. So anyways, let's get into it. So one non-empty. I got through a 20 watt bulb. Um, I don't really go through bulbs that often, but got through that. So we'll do the clamshells. Um, I got through a clam on never ending Netflix, which is creamy zucchini, sugar cookies, and cream. Love this. This is probably my number one scent from her. Zucchini bread, creamy, beautiful, rich. Oh, bakery. If you like zucchini bread, I highly re recommend giving that one a try. So good. Uh, I got through a clam of beach nights, which is toasted marshmallows, vanilla, frosted graham, salty sierra. She has a great beach nights. It's rich. It's, it's not rich. It's like... It's rich in the sense that it's like, the, the grams give it like that really creamy note, but that salty sea air comes through and it's just so good. Really good beach nights, really good performer. Got through a clam of 29 holdings, serendipity, sweet strawberries, birthday cake, another one that's fantastic. Oh, you get that serendipity, but that fresh strawberries comes through and that birthday cake makes a little bakery. This one doesn't, this one doesn't perform as well the longer you let it sit. I noticed with some of hers that they do lose a little bit. So this is one of them, but it's beautiful. I have a loaf of this. I'll always repurchase it. Last clam I got through is Mall Madness, which is espresso, sweet dough, cream cheese frosting. You really get like, it... It's hard to like, there's no like creamy, like, um, sour note. You get that coffee, but you get that dough. It's kind of like if you put a little bit of coffee into, if you were baking like cinnamon buns or something, like, no cinnamon, but you get the, like the dough. If you just put a little bit of coffee into it, that's what it smells like. Really, really good. Okay. So we'll get through my samplers that I got through. That was like one of my main things I wanted to work on. Um, apple sampler, apple butter caramel, bed night snacks. This one threw it in a bit of medium. It was nice. I would repurchase this one. I'm going to fly through these because they're kind of all similar. Um, yeah, apple sampler, horse on a porch. I forget what's in this. It's vetiver and apple. I don't like this one. It threw strong though, but I just don't care for that one. Uh, Winters in Warsaw, apple berry cinnamon, and frosted sugar cookies. This one's nice. It's just a light kind of cinnamon sugar cookie scent. I do have a tart of this. I don't know if I'd repurchase it again, but. Meet Me at Marker 715, Campfire Marshmallow Flannel Sugar Spruce. This one's really nice. I really like that. You get that, like the flannel sheets is so strong, but that sugared spruce cuts it. You can smell both of them, plus you get that little bit of marshmallow to like blend it together. Through really good. Um, I don't know how to say this word. So, Pasky. Uh, cinnamon dusted pastries, blueberry, vanilla custard. You guys know me and blueberry. We are not friends, but this one was super light, anyways, guys. Like light, medium, but probably towards light, so wouldn't repurchase that. Caffeine Before Hygiene, Sugar Cookie Latte. This one threw pretty good. This has never been like a boomer scent. But it threw pretty good through medium and I would repurchase that one. Apple Sampler, Apple Dumpling, Toasted Marshmallows and Cookies. She has na a name for this one. I'm trying to think if this is Arlette or Garnet. It might be Garnet. 
Anyways, this is nice. It's not my favorite apple. To be honest, none of these were my favorite apple. They're they were good, but they're just not my favorite. So apple again, but you know me, I'm kind of getting over it. So I don't think I'd repurchase. Candy apple and driftwood. I'm trying to think. Yeah, this one was okay. Again, I de these ones, the ones that had driftwood or like there's a few more with other stuff in it, they threw pretty well, but I don't think I'd repurchase this one. Driftwood's not my favorite note. Um, Mina. Mina is Cider Lane and Whipped Cream. I really like this one. Through Medium, I would repurchase this one. I love it. Adelfo Pirelli, I think. Um, this has... Peppermint, vanilla bean, apples, and I know I'm missing something else. Anyways, I love this scent. I really do. I don't have a peppermint person, but the blend in this one's great, and it throws pretty well. Medium. Uh, sugared apples, vanilla birch. This one's nice. Yeah, I really, I really like this one. You didn't get much apple, though. It's definitely like a vanilla birch scent with a little bit of sweetness, but I surprisingly really like that one, and it's strong, so I would repurchase that. Late Night Picnics. I forget what this one. I think it's like Apple Fritters and Marshmallow Peeps or something. The first time I ever worn this, I get nothing from it. This one threw at a medium for a little while. So, yeah, I, I'm kind of happy about that. So, I might repurchase one of those in the future. Uh, Apples, Pacific Ocean, and Vanilla Cream. This one was really nice, too. You definitely get some of that Pacific uh, Ocean. Yeah, it was beautiful. Just like fruit and like an oceanic scent kind of really, I really like it. So I probably would repurchase that one. Uh, Mac apple sugar cookies and coconut cream. This one I didn't get anything from. So unfortunately, I think I have one more tart. So hopefully that tart throws better. I'm trying to get all the apple ones done. Um... Mac apple whipped cream caramel kale corn is the only one I wrote a note for for some reason and I said it was light so I don't think I got this one at all so unfortunately uh, caramel apple and who hash who hash is Celtic green spice and sugar cookies this one's good through medium so would repurchase that apple mango tango and clothespins guys I hated this I hated it it Clothespins is probably one of my least favorite oils ever, and this was, this like threw you out of the house strong. So I put this in my bedroom, which I don't know why I did that, and the bathroom, and I could smell it all the way down the hallway. It was so bad. Strong, but not good for me. Um, apple fritters, brown sugar, vanilla, waffle cone. This was the other one that I think it's Arlet. Um, again, didn't really get much from this. So probably wouldn't repurchase and the last from the apple sampler is a libra's love and i forget what's in this one and i don't really care for this one either yeah just not a favorite strong though marshes of kent mist moss florals and pipe smoke don't like this one at all got this as a sample Ooh, she is strong and it is headache inducing that floral that's all i get so white elephant twisted peppermint on acid this was okay. It, it's a nice peppermint. I don't think I like her blends mixed with all, her fruit fly on acid. So that is like cake, cookie, vanilla, butter fudge, a vanilla mix, right? But I find it just really waters down whatever it's in. It doesn't add anything to it to me personally. Um, so, but this was okay. But I don't know if I think I have one more about when repurchase. Um, breakfast and Torin, creamy gingerbread and brown sugar latte. You guys know I don't really care for gingerbread and uh, coffee. Again, this was okay, but that spicy gingerbread and coffee just, it just, I don't know what it is about it, but not a fan, but through medium. Tiny Tim, blackberry jam, butter cooking, tea and cakes. Again, you guys know my love hate relationship with tea and cake. I don't, I don't really like this cold, but on warm, I really grew to like it. So I might get another tart. This through medium strong. And uh, yeah, it was pretty good. And the last sample size I have is Sweet Factory, which is cotton candy, sugar, lavender, vanilla lace. This is probably one of my favorites of the samples. Through medium strong. I had this in my bedroom. You just got that sweetness from the cotton candy. 
and some of that little lavender. I, I really like that sugar lavender, whatever that is. So yeah, I would 100% repurchase that. That was really good. Guys, I'm, when I tell you I didn't have a great week, I didn't have a great week, so. Uh, Forgotten Dreams, Strawberry Pancake, Dollhouse Dreams. Didn't really get a lot from this. I melted this before and it just, it could be, the, like I said, again, it could be the age, it's a year and a half old and maybe it's my fault. So some of these I'd like to revisit and melt sooner, but I'm not gonna purchase them anytime soon because I'm still working on 2021 wax, so unfortunately didn't throw. Uh, Bastian Blackberries with Cream Marshmallow Cereal Bars. I love this one. This one's so good. Her blackberry is really amazing. And mixed with that marshmallow cereal bar, I would repurchase that one. I threw about a medium. Atreyu Cocoa Butter Ooh Wood Tonka Bean Marshmallow. So the reason I'm thinking some of these are losing scent is because I had melted this one previously and I put it into my um, spreadsheet. And I said this one was strong, but now this one was like maybe light medium. So I think it's the age. Unfortunately, I don't think after like it starts decreasing after maybe a year. So I'm really going to try to use it up, but I got so much. So I really got to be more cautious. I mean, not everything decreases, but I, I found some of it did. So, uh, Artax, Marshmallow, or Back Apple and Ghost Gum. Ghost Gum's like a marshmallow mix up. This one was nice. It's nothing special. She has another blend with her Mac Apple I like better, so I wouldn't repurchase that one. Scrubbing Vacation, Island Fresh Game, Mango Sorbet. I love this scent. This is medium strong. One of my favorites, it's just that mango sorbet in laundry just is so good. Circus Stunts, Animal Cracker, <clears throat> Vanilla Buttercream, and Bing Cherry. I got a little bit of like an Animal Cracker cherry kind of note. It wasn't overly strong, but I think I'd repurchase this. Like when, at some point I'd repurchase it when I can melt it sooner because I think I've melted that in the past and it was stronger. And all this is no fault of like the vendor. Again, I'll say this. I love Ella after. Um, I really should stop buying. Like all these were pretty much from April last year. I bought like all this in April. Like I don't need to buy two or three of everything. I do, but I really got to like hone it back. She's had a sale the last week and I really wanted, lo I have loaves that I really wanted doubles of and I'm going, stop. You got to stop. You don't need two loaves. So Madagascar vanilla, musk, amber, vanilla bean. Got nothing from that, unfortunately. Again, that's vanilla scents. I'm really trying to learn not to order vanilla scents because they just don't perform in my house. Anika, Aqualina's Pink Sugar and White Clouds. Love this one, strong. Oh, it's like one of my favorite laundry blends, beautiful. Advent Day 5, Serendipity Ice Cranberry Fruit Fly on Acid. Again, blend with that Fruit Fly on Acid, but this one was really nice. I love Serendipity. Um, yeah, I would 100% repurchase that one. Day two, Advent, Captain Crunch Berries, Raspberry Jam, Fruit Fly on Acid. She renamed this to Christmas morning, I believe. This one was lighter. I pro I got a little bit of that Captain Crunch, so I would repurchase that, but I think I got a couple more, so I'm hopefully melting them sooner. I got through two, Advent Day eight, which is Celtic Blackberry, Sugar Cookies, Fruit Fly on Acid. This one's fairly light. I barely got this, so it, it last time I melted it was stronger, so unfortunately that's my fault. Hair full of secrets, Biolaw shampoo and sweet strawberries. Hated this. I didn't get any strawberries. It was just very like perm solution-y. Yeah, I just ugh. no thank you. If you like Biolaw shampoo, that's a strong one. And look, throw you a house. Um, rainbow sherbet, pineapple lime, orange raspberry vanilla. This was nice. It's just like a kind of like a fruity punch scent. Yeah, it's okay. Nothing I would buy again, but through medium. Blueberry lemon donut. Blueberry lemon vanilla cake. Just one second. Sorry, I thought I heard my boyfriend. Um, with sugary glaze, get nothing. Okay. I did two of the nothing, and it was black pepper, lavender, coconut, husk, sandalwood. This was another one that was strong last time I melted it, and it was more like medium this time. I would repurchase this one. This one, I don't know what I get. 
Like, I don't know what I get. This blends together to become a creamy, beautiful body care kind of scent. Like, it's not feminine, it's not masculine. It's just very, very beautiful body care. Would repurchase that. Another one I want to give another try to is Southern Oracles Tropical Suntan Lotion Angel Food Cake. I barely get anything out of this. This is one of my favorite scents from her. I love it. So I really want to order this when I can melt it sooner. So. I got through two of the Racing Snail, which is Vanilla Cream Crunch Cake. I think the last time I melted this too, it was a little bit stronger. But vanilla scents don't perform. So I don't think I would even give this one another chance. So because... I think I'm just throwing away money. I got through three of the urine, red grapefruit, sugar mangoes, coconut water. So this one was weird. So the first two tarts I melted, barely got anything from upstairs and downstairs. And then downstairs, the last one, it threw really well. So I don't know what happened. So you definitely get like that tartness from the grapefruit in this one. But that coconut water and sugar mango just make it like a spa scent. Yeah, it's really, really nice. So I think I might try this one again in the future. So, uh, Rock Biter, Raspberry Guava Cotton Candy Frosting. This one is super nice. I love Raspberry Guava, that beautiful, beautiful kind of fruity, sweet scent. 100% would repurchase that one. Gamork. Um, ice Lemon Tea and Cakes. Again, tea and cakes aren't friends, but this one was pretty good. I think I would repurchase this one too. If I'm in the mood for tea and cakes, this one is a nice one to melt. <sighs> Fantastica, peaches, plumeri, yellow beans, wean, and cocoa butter. I barely got anything from this. Yeah, so wouldn't repurchase. Guys, and the last two things is I got through two bags of Gathering of Misfits. It's pink sugar, lilac sugar cookie dough. I love this scent. I love this scent so much. I will always repurchase this. Yeah, 100% would repurchase this through Medium. Um, just, I, you guys know I'm not a flat floral person, but that pink sugar lilacs isn't strong in the first place and then mixed with that sugar cookie dough kind of make it a creamy kind of scent. 100% would repurchase it. So, anyways guys, that's all I got through. That's a lot of wax. I just, if I couldn't smell it, I took it out. Like I said, I'm not blaming vanilla after. Um, it could be the age. It could be my AC. Um, it could be the weather. It's been really crappy weather out. So, anyways, unfortunately, this week wasn't as good. But next week, hopefully, we're ha going to have a better week. I'm gonna, I think I got three more things that I'll after to finish up. And I'm going to use up all the other vendors. Um, yeah. So, anyways, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.